Lulu the Little Lamb's Lost Wool Lulu was a fluffy little lamb. She lived on a big green farm. Her wool was soft and white. All the other animals loved to pet her. One day Lulu woke up feeling weird. Something was different. She looked at herself in the pond. Oh no, her wool was gone. Where's my wool? Lulu cried. She ran around the farm. She looked behind trees. She peeked under bushes. No wool anywhere. Lulu met her friend, Daisy the cow. Daisy, have you seen my wool? Asked Lulu. Daisy looked confused. Moo, I haven't seen any walking wool, she said. Lulu kept searching. She bumped into Peter the pig. Peter, did you take my wool? Lulu asked. Peter snorted. Oink, why would I want wool? I like mud better. Lulu felt sad. She was cold without her wool. The other animals didn't recognize her. She looked like a skinny goat. Then she saw Henny the hen. Henny was walking funny. She looked very round and puffy. Henny, are you okay? Lulu asked. Bok. I'm fine, Henny said. But she couldn't stop sneezing. Achoo. Achoo. With each sneeze, little bits of white fluff flew out. Wait a minute. That was wool. Henny. That's my wool. Lulu shouted. Why do you have it? Henny looked sheepish. I'm sorry, Lulu. I was cold last night. Your wool looks so warm. I borrowed just a little. But it was so cozy I took more and more. Lulu laughed. Oh, Henny. You should have asked. I would have shared. Henny apologized again. She helped Lulu gather all the wool. But now they had a new problem. How could they put the wool back on Lulu? They tried glue. Sticky. They tried tape. Ouch. They even tried to tie it on with string. Silly. Just then, Farmer Joe came by. He saw the mess and chuckled. What's going on here? He asked. Lulu and Henny explained everything. Farmer Joe laughed so hard his hat fell off. Oh, you silly animals, he said. Lulu, your wool will grow back on its own. And Henny, if you're cold, come sleep in the barn. Lulu was relieved. Her wool would return. Henny was happy too. She had a warm place to sleep. From that day on, Lulu and Henny became best friends. They had sleepovers in the barn. Lulu shared her wool, and Henny shared her feathers. They made the coziest bed ever. And every spring, when Farmer Joe sheared Lulu's wool, guess who got the first fluffy blanket? Henny, of course.